Ultimately, this is all still happening and it's part of the wisdom of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala in why Allah has allowed for this to occur. Now, one of the things we can see that's happening to a lot of people is the awakening of the hearts of the ummah. Look at most of us in the West. We've become so detached from our religion. We've grown so far away from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And this is actually awakening the hearts and making them realize that without that strong connection to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, you're going to feel so vulnerable and weak and you're not going to be able to understand what's going on. We're also seeing, subhanAllah, a multitude of people wanting for the first time to read the Quran or find out about Al-Islam. So it, as much as this is extremely painful to go through, we have to also put our trust in Allah that there is a huge wisdom in why Allah has allowed for this tragedy to take place. And also remember as well that, subhanAllah, Allah only tests those whom he loves. Right. And I personally believe that the reason Allah in particular has chosen the Ahl al-Ghazza, like the people of Ghazza, to test them in such a way is Allah knew the level of their Iman, the level of their faith. And he wanted to showcase that to the world. Right. I really feel that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has chosen to showcase the, the people of Ghazza and the level of their Iman to show us where they are and where we are.